Well, hello, No Excuses Scholars. It's Music Monday, March 4th, 2024. We have a brand new No Excuse University word, mindful, the ability to be conscious or aware. Focus, awareness. Are you mindful? You can demonstrate that this week. Show that you are mindful about everything around you. All right, and it's a great time to be a mindful Husky. It's time for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand, place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Well, hey, it is Women's History Month and we're launching it today. It's for the whole month of March. Our first person is Dorothea Lang. Wow, she is a photographer, like one of the best photographers we've ever seen. During her long, prolific and groundbreaking career, she's an American photographer. She made some of the most iconic portraits of the 20th century. Iconic means memorable. It's like lasting. And these two right here are two of the most memorable of all time, especially the one of the woman and the two kids. Wow. I would recommend you do some research on her. And by the way, did you know you can have a career taking pictures, photographs? Yes. So if you like taking pictures like Dorothea, look into it just like her. So thank you, Miss Lang. That was awesome. 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 Well, speaking of awesome, it, today is Music Monday. We're going to do some karaoke. At least we're going to try. You only have a few songs to choose from, so you can't go up and say, I want to do this specific song. You have some to choose from. And yes, you can even do it with a friend. So come on up. Let's sing, sing, sing. I can't wait to hear you guys. Well, check this out. Tomorrow, yes, we're having a BMX air show. Whoa! If you were here last year, you remember these guys were incredible. I, they even jumped over some teachers. What? Yes, they did. So tomorrow, don't miss it. Be here. Oh, you don't want to miss this. It was so fun. So the BMX Air Show. And this is to get us ready for the third trimester. Get ready for state testing, SBAC. And this is also, we want to thank Mr. B, who is a gentleman who used to come to High Grove years ago and read to kids and donate. And he donated a lot of money after he passed for Highgrove. So this is, uh, uh, he, he wanted all our scholars to be able to go to cool air shows or, or sorry, assemblies, go to assemblies. And this is one of them. We'll have more to come too. Well, speaking of more to come, Husky one, two, three. Oh my gosh. I've seen some of the entries. Wow. Don't forget one minute, two minute or three minutes it can be narrative or informative. Now here's the thing. Time yourself reading it. See if it really does take a minute or two minutes or three minutes to read it. We definitely need more narratives and information uh, selections of the two and three minutes. We got a lot of one minutes. So come on, write a little bit more. So it can be two or three minutes. You can include pictures or color them. Turn it into your teacher or Mrs. Castillo. And you're going to start reading and voting. Yes, when you go to the library. So excited about this. All right, for lunch today, it looks like it's taco nada, carrot sticks, cool fruit slush. Yum, yum, yum. Well, last week we forgot to uh, talk about our college of the week, and it was uh, University of Washington, and Mrs. Curl's class represents this one. Now, I've never been to it, but just from the pictures, it looks spectacular. Now, Washington, University of Washington is in the state of Washington, which is two states above California. You've got California, Oregon, and then Washington. It is so green, so pretty up there. And just look at these buildings. Wow. And they're also the Huskies. Yeah. So let's check out one more thing about them. Let's see. 8,000, more than 8,000 undergraduates participate in at least one quarter research. So if you'd like to do research, this might be the place for you to go. Seven of their faculty members have won a Nobel Prize. Whoa, that's like the top uh, prize you can win in the whole world. And 27% of incoming freshmen are the first in their families to attend college. That's a lot. So if you are the first in your family to ever go to college, this might be a place for you to go and look into. So thank you, Mrs. Curl. What a great choice. 
All right, it's time for our joke of the day. I found this one. What falls during March but never gets hurt? Hmm, what falls down and during March but never gets hurt? Any ideas, any guesses? I can tell you one thing. It ain't Mr. Deaver because when I fall, it hurt. All right, let's find out. The rain. Of course, the rain. All right, please send me jokes. I need more. And scholars, education is our passport to the future for tomorrow belongs to the people like you and me who prepare for it today. Have a music Monday.